Right now, we're focusing on metastatic breast cancer is the use of this tool right now. And the goal is to have better means of not just prognosis, but prediction as well. And there's a very clear distinction between the two. So prognosis is no matter what you do to the patient, what's the biology of their tumor, they're going to do well or they're not going to do well, versus prediction, which is really trying to tell us if the drugs are working or not. And in different patients, these circulating tumor cells can tell us different things in terms of whether the drug's working or not, or is the disease so good that it's just going to peter along and you know, do what it's going to do. You don't have to change therapy so much. Or their disease is so aggressive that no matter what you do conventionally, you need to think out of the box and do something different. So we right now have scans to help follow patients, but we do that like every three months, every four months, and sometimes that may be waiting too long. So the goal would be to have something that is more efficient at telling us whether we're doing the right thing or not. And blood is easy as opposed to going into a scanner.